you contestants come a little closer? Now, for our next and final event, we're going to have a little contest to select the Duchess of Idaho. Ooh. Will this young lady please assist me? Now, while these young ladies are passing among you with these potatoes, I'll demonstrate just what you've got to do. You hold the potato with your hands. Don't use your hands. And then dance. <laughs> now, the couple dancing the longest without dropping the potato wins the contest. The lady wins the title, and the gentleman wins the lady, if he's lucky. <laughs> Of course, that's up to the lady. Now, will everybody get to your places? We, uh, we may change the tempo, so watch out. Now, everybody dance! <laughs> pretty good at this. I could do better if we were closer. Pay attention. I'm terribly sorry. That's perfectly all right. declare you the winners of the contest. <laughs> a green for the royal robe. <laughs> a green for the royal scepter. <laughs> and last but not least, the royal crown. <laughs> now, ladies and gentlemen, we happen to have with us tonight a celebrity from Hollywood who has kindly consented to crown the lucky lady. I refer to no other than that great personality of stage, screen, and radio, Mr. Red Skelton. Well, this is really... You both look awfully familiar to me. Red, the crown. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Miss Duncan, it's an honor to crown you the Duchess of Idaho. <laughs> I carry my own bulbs if you run out. <laughs> I would like to add, Miss Duncan, that you're the prettiest lady that a potato ever laid eyes on. Oh. <laughs> of course, being from Hollywood, beautiful girls don't bother me at all. After a while, you just sort of get used to them. Bye. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Move the platform on me when I'm looking. <laughs> 